stuff, what I did is, is we took an L screen and just placed it directly in front of the catcher. Um, so you can still see through the, the netting, you can track the pitch, um, but the ball stops, you know, a foot or two in front of your glove. So you, you can still replicate the, the setup, you can replicate the target, you can track the pitch, uh, you can absorb the catch, you know, but the ball doesn't physically touch your glove. So, um, you know, that was one way for our guys just to get back there, to, to see the movement, to see the velocity, to get comfortable um, with this particular um, pitch. And, and I think that applies to, to, to young kids as well. Just, I think sometimes we throw them into, into environments um, and, and they're catching um, an older kid and, and some, you know, a velocity they've, they've never seen before, um, you know, and they're fighting for their life, just trying to catch the ball. And I think, you know, just catching the ball isn't the goal. It's, it's being able to control the ball, uh, manipulate the catch, you know, create strikes, et cetera. And, and, if, and if all they're focused on is just not getting hurt, um, you know, I think the goal is, is not where it needs to be. So, um, so that's one way that I've done, we've done that with pros and I've done that with younger kids in camp. Like you can really overtrain in terms of the velocity, um, but eliminate, you know, the, the fear of, of actually getting injured. Uh...